So I just want to make a quick video on uh, how to save Star Wars. Disney or Lucasfilm, if you're watching, uh, just follow these simple steps and uh, we'll have Star Wars back to where it was. It's former glory. Um, so yeah, it's a strange time to be a Star Wars fan right now. The fan base is divided. There's fans threatening each other and all kinds of insults being thrown around. And I think uh, with these simple steps, we can bring the fan base back together. Uh, stop paying these analysts and wh whoever else you have on staff to, to tell you how to fix Star Wars because I'm going to tell you how to do it right now. Uh, just listen to one fan. It's just my opinion, but I'm sure a lot of people will agree with me. Uh, first of all, you're going to have to clean house. Fire anyone who's been hurling insults at the fans through social media and uh, other ways. Um, calling us man babies basement dwellers and stuff like that all that does is divide the fans um anybody who puts their political agenda first before the story fire them this will send a message to the fans uh telling us that you're putting us first now install someone like dave filoni uh who is a star wars fan and understands the story and understands what we want as the head of lucasfilm uh take all politics out of Star Wars for at least the next couple movies because um, it's just been too much it turns me off every time I see like uh, blatant politics in any movie not just Star Wars uh, so yeah just just like take take politics out all it does is divide people and I go to the movies to escape politics so I don't have to deal with it for a couple hours and just chill and watch a movie Include lightsabers and the Force in every Star Wars movie. That's that's kind of like half the reason why I go to a Star Wars movie because I love seeing lightsabers. I love seeing Jedi. I love seeing Sith. I love seeing the Force. Um, these uh, spin-off movies haven't had any of that, so I just feel like uh, if you just put that in these spin-offs, I think I think it'll help a lot. If you're gonna do a spin-off movie, make sure it's one that the fans want. Uh, there is there are many videos online about what we want, like uh, acceptable characters to make movies on. Of course, Obi Wan Kenobi is a good choice. I don't want to see any more young Star Wars spin-offs, like young baby Han Solo, baby this. Uh, you know what I mean? I, I want to see I want to see movies that are played by the actors that that originally played them. Um, if they're too old or they can't do it, then I. I I would just rather not see it. Boba Fett's a fine character to make a spin-off of. Uh, we just don't want characters that we just don't care about have their own movies. Have the next movie, which will be episode 9, to uh, have Marvel-level fan service in it. I'm talking Marvel-level. Bring in characters that we love. Just make it great. So that brings me to episode 9. Um, in order to fix Star Wars at this point, episode 9 is going to have to be like the best Star Wars movie that I've ever seen okay which means um the first thing you're gonna have to do is bring back Luke Skywalker we already saw matter being transported through the force with uh with the scene when Kylo Ren had like the water on his glove after he was visiting with Rey then Rey and Kylo Ren touched hands um so it's totally possible with the canon that you have now to bring Luke Skywalker back uh, just have him maybe transported somewhere. I mean, his metal arm didn't even drop, so, <laughs> like, it's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. Maybe have Luke possibly affected by that uh, dark side pit on the island or something, or maybe by Snoke. Maybe Snoke had him under some kind of weird dark trance that made him very fearful and, and hiding and just want to die or something like that. Uh, it's totally easy to do. Make Luke Skywalker... The most epic Jedi that we've ever seen. Bring him back with his green lightsaber. Make him have some kind of epic battle. Maybe have him save Rey. Um, I think that would be a good touch. Don't tell us that he's back in, in the trailers either. Just just show, maybe show, um, maybe show a sneak peek of uh, maybe Rey picking up a lightsaber. Kylo Ren picking up his lightsaber and then maybe like a gloved hand picking up a green lightsaber give us that and i guarantee you everybody that's angry about episode eight will come back for episode nine i guarantee it if you do this then the fans will definitely forgive 
everything that's that's been done to their favorite characters yeah that's all you would really have to do to save episode 9 and save this trilogy maybe have Rey be defeated and have Luke Skywalker come and save her um, that would be a nice touch maybe show some background on Snoke possibly a final battle between Snoke and Luke Skywalker and it would be easier to bring Snoke back too because he's so powerful and there's all these force powers that we're just now learning about one thing I noticed at the end of episode 8 is that after Snoke died uh, Kylo Ren and Rey had another one of those like force conversations w with each other I'm under the impression that Snoke was causing those so I mean he could still be alive still continuing on with his plan uh, that would that would be a great way to have a really cool fight between Luke Skywalker and, and Snoke and for the next trilogy uh, maybe have it said in like the Old Republic uh, give us give us epic new characters give us really deep characters that we want maybe a Darth Revan trilogy there are a lot of uh, fans of Darth Revan and if you brought him into canon I think that would be that would really have a lot of fans super excited um, you'll make so much money if you listen to, to the things I just said and just implement that you'll make a ton of money just like pitch me like a buck fifty for a drink I'll go out and get a drink and I'll know that I'll know that you were listening uh, so th thanks for watching um, if you like this video I make content like this all the time just give me a give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next time thanks